Ladies and gentlemen, now entering the cage, heading five feet, five inches tall, weighing at 185 pounds, with a mixed martial art record of eight wins and 17 losses, representing Iron House Gym from Mason City, Iowa. This is the Mason City Man. Manny Quiro's coming all the way up from Mason City, Iowa. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away about, uh, I don't know, about an hour's drive. He's got Travis Fulton in his corner. Travis has a lot of experience. I don't know if they've been training together, fighting together, or what. I know that uh, Travis has been known to put on his own shows in the area. So I can assume that Manny's probably got a lot of backyard experience. So he's not going to be afraid to stand and trade, and he's not going to be afraid to bring. Well, it says here his record's 8 and 17. So he's got some good fights under his belt, apparently. His opponent now entering the cage, hitting six feet, four inches tall, pointing at 180 pounds, with a mixed martial art record of one win and no losses. Representing the Minnesota Martial Art Academy from Anoka, Minnesota, this is Cade Sunshine the Minnesota Martial Arts Academy. I've never actually gotten a chance to train with him there, but I did see him fight in their first smoker event as he fought a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu blue belt. Uh, the fight was mainly taking place on the feet standing. I think it was even ruled a draw, but uh, he wound up causing a lot of damage in his opponent, who I still don't believe has returned back to training full time. Um, he's not afraid to bang. He'll throw kicks, he'll throw punches, he'll throw knees, and he's hard to take down too. So this you got a lot of power in the one corner, and you've, you've got a lot of uh, reach and technique in the other corner. Let's see how effective that reach is. Oh, oh. he goes for a flying knee and clears Manny. That was great. Now Six he inches lower. Single. Shoots a single. His neck is caught, but I think he can get out of this. Yeah, and he's passing, passing the uh, side mount there. Uh, but Manny stands up, has a standing guillotine, and tries to throw a knee to the body. And now we're down to his full guard. Kid is, uh, he's got to give up on that flying knee. He tried it twice and really didn't set it up. Now he's, he's eating some leather. Some hurtful shots with his head against so he's the He's framing cage. up a triangle, but he's, he's really got his body posture broken because of the cage there. And he gave it up. Back to full guard. Spinning off the cage there. He's looking for that triangle again. Yeah, he's got the arm bar. There it is. That's it. A little tap. Manny kind of fell into that arm bar there. You could see the triangle was being set up, and I think he turned on his side to avoid it, and the arm bar was the next step. Yep. And that's where it finished. Good job by Cage. Seven seconds of a round.